Hey, once again, this is Robert with Clean Pool and Spa. In this video, I'm going to talk about uh, water testing and specifically test strips versus test kits. Now, a lot of people use test strips. Uh, one of the big ones is AquaCheck test strips. Uh, they're safe, easy, and convenient. And I just don't want to single out AquaCheck because there's there's lots of brands out there. But just test strips in general. <clears throat> and now, uh, again, they're safe, easy, and convenient. You dip them in the, in the water just within a few seconds. They change colors, and you hold up and you match match the colors to to the um, uh, to the colors on the bottle. And while it's convenient and it's fast, it, they are notoriously not accurate. And that may offend some people, it may even offend the manufacturers, and that's okay. Uh, this is just my opinion, what I've seen. Uh, I've been doing pools since 1999. Um, I'm a real pool guy. I had a route in Arizona, and I was a pool operator for the YMCA uh, for about three years in Oregon. And the test kit that I've always used is this one. It's a K2006 pool water test kit. Um, <clears throat> to the best of my knowledge, the Arizona Department of Health still uses this. I know for a fact that the Oregon Department of Health uses this particular test kit. Uh, they would have reps come in to the Y three, four times a year uh, that they were unannounced and they would test the water and I had to be sure that the water was correct every single day. I had to be perfect all the time because I didn't know when they were coming in. So the records had to be there, the readings had to be correct, and this one gives you the actual numbers. Now if you open it up, you can see there's, there's the directions up here. This is color coded with the bottles here. Uh, and this test for the chlorine, combined chlorine, peach, alkalinity, calcium hardness, and cyanuric acid. Those are the six areas that you want to test for. Now, uh, as I'm filming this right now, uh, I have not made videos on how to use this test kit. Um, I just called my neighbor down the street and she's going to allow me to use her pool. And I'm planning on making a series of videos on how to exactly use this test kit. I'm going to take you step by step uh, on what to do and why to do it and how, and, and how to do it and the techniques that you need to employ in order to get the most accurate reading. Now, in case you're, you're a little, uh, you know, afraid of using a kit like this, let me tell you that I taught about 25 guards at the Y how to use this particular test kit. Now, many of these were kids, 16, 17 years old, still in high school. Uh, they never had a pool, never took any kind of testing at all, never used a pool test kit. And within a, just about maybe a week or so, two weeks, they were able to master this. And they were able to troubleshoot pool water. And I, I just anything and everything. Okay, so no truer statement has ever been said that, believe me, if they can use this, you can too. And again, I'm going to make videos very, very simple, but step by step on exactly how to use this to get the most accurate readings. Uh, so that's uh, kind of the differences between uh, test strips and the K2006 pool water test kit. That's the one that professionals use. I've used it and it gives you the most accurate reading. So I hope that helps. Like, subscribe, comment, check out the description box below. Lots of good information over there. So uh, until next time, I'm Robert with Clean Pool and Spa. Thanks for watching. Be safe and happy swimming. Bye.